to 2022, I'm thinking about what sort of leadership do I need to display? What sort of leadership is going to enable my clients to achieve the greatest success? And there's a part of how leadership works that will determine the outcomes you get. I see leaders as connectors. The best leaders, they connect people with themselves. They connect people with each other. They connect people with ideas. They connect people with strategy and action. They are natural connectors, making it simple for people to connect with each other and where they're going. There's another set of leaders that I would say focus on separating people, separating people, creating factions, creating difference, uh, exploiting difference in people. And we see that in the political spectrum. We also see that in the corporate world where occasionally a leader is dividing their team or focusing on just a few and it creates division. Now, if you're gonna be great at creating division, what do you have to do? You need to focus on what people fear. What scares them? If you're leading a country, what scares them? Uh, terrorism, a pandemic, uh, people who don't think like them, people that don't look like them. Use those things to separate and divide. Uh, and that is a form of leadership. The leadership that will make the biggest difference coming into 2022, creating a world better led, are those leaders that are focused on connection. So the leaders that focus on connection look for common ground. They actually look at the humanity in other people and help people see the humanity in one another. Find each other's best. They look at helping people connect purpose and action. That is a connecting leader. So in 2022, ask yourself the question, what can I do to be a connecting leader, to connect my people, connect with them, and connect them to the direction we're taking so they can go together?